The Massachusetts State Police has been dealing with a series of scandals in recent months, including questionable overtime charges by some state troopers. And now the Massachusetts Attorney General is calling on Governor Charlie Baker to take action. The host of Newsmakers, Tim White, is here now with the details. New at 530. It's an election year for Republican Governor Charlie Baker and political analysts we talked to say the state police case could be a scandal his opponents try to exploit. Following a state audit, 20 active Massachusetts state troopers and one retiree may face sanctions for allegedly not working overtime they charge the state for. This comes after the former colonel was found to have scrubbed an arrest report of a judge's daughter. Again, I think it's up to the Baker administration to lead on this. Massachusetts Attorney General Maura Healey is leading an investigation to see if criminal charges are warranted on the overtime issue. But the Democrat said Thursday Governor Charlie Baker needs to address it administratively. I think this is a matter of transparency, accountability, and I think it's time that the Baker administration take a leadership role in this issue. When she lashed out at Baker, uh, it, was, it was through an open-ended question, actually. Mass Live reporter Gin Doomchis says was... the state police scandal could be problematic for Baker. I think this one is particularly dangerous because it's a, such, a, such a clear issue of public trust. Right, so, uh, Lauren Dzinski of Politico Massachusetts it's... agrees this could be political ammunition for Baker's challengers, but he'll still be tough to beat. He's the nation's most popular governor. His poll ratings are, you know, his, his approval ratings have remained high. In a WBUR Mass Inc. poll out last week, Governor Baker's approval rating is at 66 percent, and 60 percent of voters say for now they would choose him over any of his challengers. Tim White, Eyewitness News.